Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to place the Facebook page view pixel using Google Tag Manager. First, you'll want to make sure that you have Google Tag Manager installed on your website. If you're not sure or you don't have it installed, go ahead and reach out to your develop developer to get that set up. Once you have it set up, you can come back to this video to get started with your Facebook page view pixel. First, you'll want to go into Events Manager and make sure you have a pixel created. And once you do, you can select Add Events and press from a new website, select install code manually and copy the entire pixel base code to your clipboard. Once you have it copied, you can X out of here and go into your Google Tag Manager and make sure to select the container that is associated with your website. Once you're in the workspace, you will see a button in the left hand corner that says new tag, add a new tag. So go ahead and select that. And first, you'll want to name your tag. I'm going to name this Facebook page view pixel. And then select tag configuration and scroll down to where it says custom and select custom HTML. Here in this HTML box, you'll want to um, paste the Facebook pixel code that you copied over from events manager and then scroll down to the triggering section and make sure to have this fire on all pages. Next, you'll want to press save, and then it'll take you back to the main screen, but it won't be published yet. So now press submit, and then press publish. Once you've done that, your page view pixel should be set up, but you can go back to your website and double check using the um, Facebook pixel extension, the Facebook pixel helper extension. And as you can see, um, page view is firing on my website. So now that we have that set up, we can go ahead and get started with our standard events or custom events, which we will dive into in a later post. Thanks for watching.